Uh, hello and welcome to more World War II 172 scale. Today we're looking at a pre-built die cast and plastic dragon model of the hunting tiger, uh, the big boy of the battlefield. 72 tons, the largest vehicle in mass production in World War II. They only got about 100 of these built. They were in special Panzer Jaeger Abteilungs. Ah, they've got a gun that's even bigger than the 88. They've got 128 millimeter on this one. See, they've got the Zimmerit on the side. A rather unusual type of paint job, a number on there. It's got a bow machine gun. Let me try to take a look here. Oh, look at it. Very sloped frontal armor and thick. 150 millimeters to 200 millimeters thick. Nothing can penetrate it from the front. And on the side, it was over 80 millimeters thick. Pretty good. And it was thick on the back, too, about that 80 millimeters. Ah, uh, there was one story I read in a book that, uh, see the big back doors there? That on the western front, it's like Battle of the Bold Chime or something, that they had those open for whatever reason. And like a Sherman tank or something, fired right in there and destroyed it. Oh, my goodness. Mm. These are so heavy. One of the main problems with them was breaking down and keeping them <coughs> maintained to go forward. They were too heavy for a lot of bridges to be on. So if it was at a distance and firing, it was good. If they came against it in a dug-in or a prepared position, and they only had to attack it from the front, very hard to do. Of course, on the Western Front, especially, they had a lot of planes that could help out to attack uh, armor from the top. And this was thicker than most tanks on the top, but still vulnerable. Ah, uh, So that's another look at a nice 172 scale world war ii vehicle thanks for liking and subscribing until next time thank you